right. So I can't get any of the actual guide stuff working. Hold on, let's stop so I don't get that up. See, it says do that, but I don't know what it means. It's obviously pull the trigger. But I pull the trigger. That goes off. Am I supposed to hold it down? Do you know what I mean? Nothing. Well, that's what I thought, like that. But annoying, you can turn the light off. Which doesn't really do a lot here. So I'll do that for now. I'll look at the forum later. But, I mean, look at the roof. Supposedly the Sistine Chocolate says on that um, plaque, it's Ramsey's the second's wife, and he was like really famous forever. And he like, before the decline, I think. Um, yeah, these cartouches, these ovals with the lines underneath, so these are names. Scarab's rebirth symbol, so it's, it's over here quite a bit. Um, two lions supporting the disc, I think. I mean, look at the quality. I was creeping us out though originally because of that over there. <laughs> I had to keep telling myself there wasn't any zombies. No mummies. See these? So there's a the Cyrus. There's the infinity symbol. Two infinities around the disc. You've got Cheetah. That's the capitated and it's blood sort of flowing into that pot. And it's tails curve round. See that? Which is pretty much the two affinities. Um, so Cyrus was, he had a wife Isis, that's the yin yang there, and then they had an opposite pair, which was Set and Nephis, I think it is. And Set, jealous of Cyrus, got 72 conspirators and chopped them up into pieces, threw his pieces all over the land, and Isis had to go around and collect them all up. And basically, she did that. He was reborn as Lord of the Underworld, as Horus. Um, was the child that came from him while he was dead. Um, you've got six serpents, and five feathers. The feather being Order or Mat, the goddess, which was Truth. And you've got on this side five serpents and four feathers showing this like reduction down. I mean, it's intentional. I didn't build anything without intention. There's a Cyrus again. He's always got the green face. He's over there with a scarab for a face because that's also a symbol. Rebirth. There's the canoptic jaws, I think. Um, see, I kind of trigger that. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'll have to look at them. I've counted them multiple times and I kind of get a 35 is my best count. And that's strange because you would think it was 36. Because they divided the sky into 10. So yeah, there was 36 um, gods, they said. Anyway, there's Anubis. He guards the underworld. Well, hold on. So I've got that stupid thing on. Right. I don't know who this is with that symbol. No idea. I don't even know what that is. It's like a mirror or something, maybe. It's strange. It's not an animal. Um, you've basically got a side. Uh, Horus, sorry. Yeah, Horus there with a the disc with a serpent around. A disc. I'm not sure who that is, but with Horus, I think, standing on top, it's probably Isis. So basically, she's the virgin, and she, and he is Jesus in Egypt. Um, 
a scorpion or something on that head. See that? It's very odd. It's also got symbols on it, actually. It's got a five point star up there. On the arm. One on each arm. Um, I could be cancer. The actual constellation, I don't know. So, here, yeah, we've got Isis, and we've got these three gods here on the thrones, with the vulture above the door. You've got that alchemical jar, that was King Tut's perfume jar they marked it as. But look, that's a heart, the bottom's a heart on this. And here you've got differences in this, the two sides of the way they're represented. One's like fuller. I didn't see that. He's too bright, these torches. I didn't see it anyway. That's a Cyrus with his scalp head. And this whole room in here, I think, is about production and, and eating the god because you've got it's all Hathor. All of the cows. Oh, it's even got like a map to them on that one. Showing the bones and everything. Oh, bugger. I mean, not the quality. It's just amazing. You know what I mean? What's picked up? That's probably a thought, I would have thought. Which is just a ISIS in the form of produce, the bull, the milk, and the horns with the crescent, obviously. I mean, look at this. This is crazy. This is where it's getting its name, the Sistine Chapel of Hieroglyphs from. So that's a proper art, that. And a cow on the bottom there. Again, they've got the, the alchemical jars there. That's Ramses, the second, I'm pretty sure. Because he's back to back with Osiris, and this is his wife's tomb. I don't know whether he died first or what. All the stars again. That's Thoth. I'm not sure who that is, but wearing the double, it's probably Isis. So the vulture on her head. There was another set of legends, which was the Ogdod, and there was four pairs, males and females. I think the males had crocodile heads, and the females, <coughs> the females had frog heads. Well, there's the frog there, because they transformed, don't they? Look at that one. It's beautiful. Everything. It's probably one of the best ones to to be uh, have access to. So I mean, this is just the first little bit. Yeah. It's here where it gets really interesting. As soon as you walk into here, you've got serpents up the walls with the cartouche names. So this must be her name. Oh. And you've got like offerings to Isis. I think in different forms. That's with that um, symbol. Scorpion or whatever. Moves down in there. Yeah, changes from Isis to Isis near them. Um, with the wings. Continues on. A serpent reducing down on both sides. You've got Anubis as a sphinx guarding the entrance, and you've got the eyes of Ra and Horus either side. And that's like an awesome example of the statues that you see for Isis. So, this must have been the tomb, it's been completely robbed. It's just the best example. Really, of hieroglyphs, um, untouched tomb. Now, these all these poles have got a cyrus on, there's four of them as pillars holding up um, the stars, I guess. And there's the cheetah symbol again up the sides, bleeding into the bowl at the bottom and the spiral at the top, either side. No idea what all that says. 
got a lot of cloudless here. Um, I'm not sure what that, who that is. Should be easy to pinpoint. But the one with the, I think that's baboon here. That's probably Thoth in his baboon form. Got it about this one. It's all damaged. Well, there's Thoth with a really well detailed eye above. Same on that side. So I would like to see what that says in the middle. And you've got these two winged serpents, like a gateway, right on this stage. A pillar with arms holding two anchors. Um, I wonder whether that's. Oh, I wish that would work. Um, I'm putting something in the mouth, I think. Can't really see what it is, or if anything. Look at all these. Sounds like a gate, and that guy. Oh, who is that? I think it's like the older gods. That one's strange. This one's got two snakes for horns. <coughs> Let me do some reading. There's the pillars as well. So it's either Osiris or the pillar. Or this place which is looks like... <coughs> The same as on the others, I guess. All damaged over here. Little room. Similar entrance with almost nothing in it. <coughs> Anubis, Isis, Osiris, the four jars. These are like offerings or something for the this must have been where the tomb was. The sarcophagus. These... <laughs> these are the gates. Because the demo showed that that one talks about that being the fifth guardian. So I want to hear what that says. It's weird. Or the head. I think it's that one, to be honest. This one, not that one. We'll see. So, Sekhmet over here. A crocodile god. And again, there's an awesome winged Isis over here. Stood. Totally damaged. Generally, I mean, it's it's in really good condition, isn't it? Like all this. See, look, they've got the cheat, the wear and the cheater on this side, which was here, either side of. Was it dead? That's it. I think I'll try the other ones. See what it's like. Favourite bits of those, these coming down. The winged Isis across here and the noobs and the eyes and everything, that's amazing. And this 6 to 5, 5 to 4. That. That symbol everywhere. This entrance. And this symbol. <laughs>